Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, please consider subscribing. But you guys know what time it is. We're going to be discussing everything Solana, see what is happening with the price of Solana, and of course, what we could be expecting as we go further into the month of March. You know, for looking at the um, you know daily time frame, you know, starting to see coins going back into the green. You know, because Bitcoin is pushing back up towards all time highs you've heard that correct you know we did see a massive bloodbath yesterday you know as we started off the day because you know we did see you know about a 15 percent pullback as we almost retested all-time highs yes some exchanges were able to see uh the all-time high but you know we did see a massive massive shakeout but since that shakeout is done you know we're seeing market rebounding very very quickly and you know the market going back to where it kind of left off especially if you're looking at the last hourly time frame you're seeing quite a bit of green across the board but as far as Solana is concerned you know it's still not making those massive massive moves but you know we're going to be discussing what exactly is next for Sol and of course what we could be expecting as I said earlier so you know if you're looking at the price of Solana as of March the 6th the price is currently sitting at $129.70. You know, down about 2.6% over the past 24 hours in USD comparative. And if we're looking at it in the BTC comparative, you know, we're seeing sold down about 6%. But if you're looking at its market cap, guys, market cap is currently sitting at $57.6 billion with the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 6.8 billion so you know in terms of the way it's holding right now it's looking amazing you know obviously we did see that pullback yesterday you know the significant flash crash um you know that was uh due to the impact of bitcoin seeing a flash crash but we're going to talk about how good soul is holding right now so before we do get into it as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in crypto so we're going to start off with some of the news for you guys so you can see shout out to solana floor um you can see it says breaking solana daily decentralized trading volume skyrocketed over 2.4 billion dollars driven by significant surge of funds into solana meme coins and speaking about this guys i'm seeing this firsthand now you guys might be saying how do you see this firsthand you know i have some of my friends that are reaching out to me you know that haven't really spoken about cryptocurrencies over the past you know last bull cycle you know when the things were starting to heat up and you know the same exact people are reaching out to me and saying you know crypto zx um obviously they're using my personal name but um, you know they're saying wait you know why um is the xyz coin pumping up and you know the examples these guys are giving me is pepe you know bonk and with token you know with token is one of the ones that are being spoken about a lot so you know this just gives you an indication as to how much interest these meme coins are bringing and imagine how early we were you know back in uh, november october september if you watch my updates during those times if you remember i predicted that you know the solana meme coin mania will bring in a lot of eyes on solana because no one likes ethereum yeah you know uh, meme coins reason why that's the case is because do you really think you know people that already have small amounts of money to actually you know invest into these meme coins or you know try to uh take that gamble like at the end of the day you know when it comes to meme coins you're taking a gamble not every meme coin is going to get to the level of you know whiff token you know the level of bonk so you know you need to really understand as to how um you're entering the uh, meme coin market and what kind of risks associated to it but you know people no longer want to uh, use the ethereum uh, blockchain they already know the amount of fees that are associated with one single transaction and this is where the beauty of chains like solana comes into play and boy is this coming right into reality as we speak and you know as far as nft goes and again you know this is something if you're an OG, um, you know, subscriber, you know, we've been talking about that Solana NFTs are going to see a pop. And you can see this for yourself. We saw Mad Lad surpass Bored Ape. Guys, Bored Ape. Are you kidding me? And this is a mutant one, but still, like, that's insane. You know, we're looking at a 235.3 million. And I think, you know, Bored Apes are, you know, something in the past. Obviously, they will hold, um, you know, the overall presence as far as that is concerned. But, you know, new NFTs are coming in play. And, you know, obviously, Mad Lads is the biggest one on Solana. So that is really, really nice to see, of course. And you can see this for yourself. Solana saw an inflow of over 90 million in stable coins over the past 24 hours. Again, not a surprise. And lastly, Jupiter Exchange total volume 
surpasses 94 billion. Why is this the case now, you may be asking? Why is Jupiter Exchange being used so much? Because people want to get their hands on these coins. So insane stuff that we're seeing here, guys. Do subscribe to me on Twitter if you have not yet already done so. But now let's take a look at Solana's DeFi. So as you guys know, Solana's DeFi has been on the climb. You know, obviously if we're seeing a lot of people farming, number one, and a lot of, you know, other uh, chains money flowing into Solana. What do you think that's going to do to, uh, you know, the overall Solana's total value locked? Obviously, it's going to increase. And literally in the last seven days, to be exact, we have seen around $500 million flow into the Solana, uh, you know, DeFi just in the last seven days alone and that should just tell you how much interest there really is for Sol right now and as far as BTC's price is concerned though you know if you're looking at Bitcoin dominance it's going down right now a little bit but you know if you're looking at BTC guys you know Bitcoin is pushing up and Bitcoin main target right now is to break towards all-time highs and you know someone made a really really good point I was unable to share that with you guys but you know the point was that you know last time you know Bitcoin reached an all-time high um, you know it had a retracement of about 15 percent and we all saw this time around as well you know as soon as uh, we did reach an all-time high we saw about a 15 percent pullback and then after that you know we did see bitcoin pumping up about 240 percent is history going to repeat itself of course you know this time around we do have massive institutional interest you know first time ever um, and obviously that is going to push and you know we're seeing what's happening with btc right now the fact that bitcoin is you know testing all-time highs before the happening is Itself just speaks for itself so you know that is really really exciting to see and honestly i can see bitcoin breaking out um you know if we do see a daily candle close around here so that is exciting of course but now let's take a look at solana because you know what solana has done and yes i've seen some comments and you know you will see these comments when uh, you know you do see some negative momentum in the markets you see these comments flowing in and you know these are people that honestly don't understand how cryptocurrencies work you know yesterday when we saw that flash pullback due to bitcoin you know we were sitting at, at about 144 dollars obviously that was a yearly high so if you want to put that move into perspective we did see about a 25 percent pullback for solana um you know due to bitcoin's move yesterday and again as you guys know when bitcoin drops 14 percent generally altcoins tend to drop double and you know we had seen that happen with solana but you can see this for yourself solana retested the 108 dollar support that good old resistance that uh you know we kept on talking about back in uh you know the month of february as you guys know the significance of that resistance that was been telling you guys and i'm sure at this point everyone really understands the significance of that resistance um but you know once we popped out of there but this time around look at that guys this beauty you know we got supported by that range and we are seeing you know solana picking up back pretty much where it left off at that key resistance you know you can't make these things up you know these resistances that i have been telling you guys day in day out every solana update you know speak for themselves right these are major major support lines either or they're major Major key resistances and you can see this for yourself you can't make this up as of recording this update where is the price of Solana currently sitting at it's retesting that exact resistance so as far as um, us hitting a new yearly high or retesting that's still a move of about 10.6 percent and if we're able to see Bitcoin bouncing towards an all-time high I think we could see this push back happening so what you want to be seeing as a Solana holder right now is to see the price get back in the 0.50 Fibonacci retracement level we still have a lot of time until the daily candle closes for the day but you want to see the daily candle closing in the 0.50 if not above this key resistance and i think we are off to the races back towards um you know a new yearly high and obviously you know we're getting closer and closer guys uh, to the 150 dollar price point and that is where you know i think just people are going to be shocked at that fact the fact that you know so one soul costed a single 28 bucks back in october and right now, literally a few months later, we're sitting at $128 with a yearly high of $142. Just speaks for itself. And you know the amount of developments that are coming for Solana, I'm sure everyone that's holding Solana understands how huge it is. And of course, that Coca-Cola news just is a cherry on top. So cannot be more excited about the Solana future. Um, so far, you know, this bull run is going exactly as planned. You know, Solana is uh, the massive, massive, you know, project that everyone has their eyes around. And I think it's going to continue like this and I cannot be more excited. But again, only time is going to tell. Do let me know down below what you guys personally think. Love each and every one of you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for all your support. It means the world to me. We'll see you tomorrow in Crypto CX and peace out.